this is Kelsey Brown for thenetballcoach.com and today we're going to start with a drill that incorporates a lot of my favourite moves on the court. This drill is for mid-quarters and goalers but focuses on making sure that mid-quarters land on the ring, making sure the goaler is presenting at an appropriate time and making sure that the continuous play and the continuous workload of a mid-quarter is simulated in this drill. So to begin for the setup, we're just going to have two players on the transverse line. We've got two centre court players setting up just in front here. And you can either start with a one-on-one -on -one in the ring or you can start um, two-on-one, two-on-two. Um, it just depends on, on what you're looking for in that goal ring. Okay, we're going to start with the ball on the transverse line. <clears throat> These two players are going to split, so just walk through it. Split, two leads. <clears throat> the person who doesn't get the ball is going to front cut onto the ring. So we want to land directly on the ring. We don't want to land off it. <clears throat> That's what we're looking for. As soon as she's on the ring and facing into the circle, our goaler is going to present. Not too early, not too late. She's going to present either a, a, a front ball, a lob, a bounce pass, just so that that feeder has to make a split second decision of what she's going to feed. So the offer's there, the pass. As soon as she gets the ball, she's not shooting it, she's throwing the ball out. This means that the drill is then continuous. The center court players are running over to the other side, coming together, starting again. Split, onto the ring. Yep, goal option. After the fourth rep, or as many repetitions as you want to do, Goaler can have a shot, end of the drill. Yep, go for it. <clears throat> awesome. <clears throat> Throwing the ball out, split, onto the ring, turn and offer. Up. So with this part of the drill, what we're getting is, uh, it's a two on one out the front. So the mid quarters have one defender. The defender's going to go with one of the players. Depending on whether that person's got the ball or not, they're going to front cut the defender and land on the ring. If the mid quarter doesn't land on the ring when the defender's on her, then the mid quarters can just work again until they do land on the ring. Um, the job of the defender out the front is just to make it hard for the, the mid quarters to get on that circle. Go. That's it. Nice. There she is. Go again. Come together. Split. And yes. Nice work. Up. Split, go. Good job, nice roll. You can also incorporate moves like rolls, screens, just to try and get free of that defender, especially if it's a two on two at the front here with the mid quarters, making sure that those mid quarters are then using their brains and making sure that they're using every sort of trick in their book to get free, get onto that ring.